So it's easy to criticize, but they're really criticizing science because I represent science. I hope you enjoyed this week's episode of Who's a Cheeky Chappy? And before that, I hope you enjoyed The History of Chainmail with Lester Biggins. And now, boys and girls, it's time to visit our little friend. So, so I don't have a... I don't believe in a god. Right? However, um, I don't like the, uh, the, 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 the antagonism that, 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 that occurs or is produced by this question. I mean, what you can say if, you, if you're a cosmologist, what you should say is so, so we know that the universe was very hot and dense 13.8 billion years ago. Uh, we don't know how it got hot and dense. We don't even know, actually, if the universe had a beginning in time. Don't know. I didn't get a friend on friend day because all the other children thought they would catch scurvy from me. But also, would you seem to be going backwards? Like, you talk in the book about how we now have to <clears throat> listen to people saying the Earth is flat. Yeah. Uh, yes, that, that's, that's one of the pieces in there is about the, the, new, uh, the new Flat Earth International Conference. It isn't a conference from the 14th century. This is a conference that started, I think, in 2017. And it is a growing thing. And that's because people are so contrarian, people are so willing to believe unsubstantiated things that have websites, that they are now going back on the conclusion we have all rightly drawn about the shape of the planet we live on. <laughs> Do you know what this is? Do you? Do you know what this is? This is a drawing of my little white English bum. <laughs> and so, you know, we get to the limit of our knowledge, and I think really what you're trying to say is we need to be careful not to go beyond yeah. what we know. The, the great, great so, Richard Feynman, the great Nobel Prize winner, he, he, it's a beautiful quote where he says that, um, he, he says, what is the meaning of it all? <laughs> and, he said, uh, and he says, in the end, we have to admit that we do not know. But in admitting that, we may have found the open channel. That's the key to science. We don't know. Mm. David? Do you believe we live on a globe? Do you believe that men have won? It's BBC One, and it's five o'clock. By people, I mean idiots. <laughs> That's the closest you're going to get to looking at my bum, bum lookers, all of you. And you've got people out there spouting complete nonsense about a vaccination. It, they, they are totally wrong. Thanks a lot for searching that out. I appreciate that. Fisherman in the box. Fisherman in a box.